What's up, everybody? You already know who it is. DJ Ultra definitely in the building. And right now, this is NY to LA Radio. We got a very, very important guest as always. But what's more special about this one? He's actually in Paris. You know, same musician and a poet. What's going on, man? Hi. Everything's good. Yeah. I'm really that's... happy to be on your show. Nice, nice, man. It's actually great that you're actually on the show, man. We actually didn't know that we were out there reaching, you know, people in Paris, which is awesome. Well, actually, you're, you're kind of close to Paris. Tell our listeners where exactly you're from. I'm from Créteil, a little town near Paris. It's uh, the Paris suburbs. And uh, this is a, a, a nice town, uh, very pleasant to live in Créteil. Nice. And uh, there is a, a, lot of, uh, a lot of activities for the youth. This is a nice town. Nice, nice. So let's talk about you know your, your last work, your album. What, like, what is one of your favorite tracks that you did? Matter of fact, tell of all our listeners your name first, man. I'm Han Sino. Han Sino. Han Sino. Nice, nice. So now let's get back into your work, man. So what was like one of your favorite songs that you did? Wow, well, um, I think my last album is very interesting. There is uh, different colors, but uh, one of my favorite songs is "Deeply Sleeping." Nice. It's a very, very smooth song, very, very slow, very mel- uh, melodic, nice tunes. This is a good song. So, so which one do you like doing more? More of the music or more of like the, the poems? Or do you just think they're almost like the same thing? Well, this is very different. Uh, music is something very uh, linked to the feelings and the emotions. Um, it is also a kind of poetry. Music is also a kind of poetry, but this is different. Uh, poetry is more um, is more intellectual in a way, but this is this is different. This is different. I like poetry, but when I do music, I think it's easier for me to speak to everyone and to uh, make everyone feel something uh, interesting, some, something be- uh, beautiful, something pleasant in life. Uh, good vibrations, uh, good times, etc. Cool, cool, cool. I actually like that. So that, now, now your last album, what matter of fact, what separates you from other artists that actually are in Paris and out in France? Like, what makes you so unique? Well, I think um, France is not uh, is is a great country for music, but it is not enough. It is not creative enough. I think I'm a, I'm a more innovative, more creative than uh, the average musician in France. The average known known musician in France, known musician in France. Uh, I try to make something creative, but I also try to pay tribute to the great music with my own capacities, with my own own abilities, and to propose something different something fresh uh, something very groovy but uh, in a new way uh, my, my, my kind of new jazz I'm a new jazz artist and my kind of new jazz is very personal very psychedelic very different it is a, a dreamlike a dreamlike music um, a very sweet music a very uh, funky jazzy and also a kind of urban music but uh, with deep roots all right so so now do you feel as if that it's it's hard for artists in in france to get put on mainstream or do you think it's easier because you know america right now you could say it's like the the soul for music you know everybody wants to come to america or even like the uk into music and a lot there's not a lot of france artists out here so do you think that like you know there is a special part for artists in france or it's harder like like what's your take on that it depends on a lot of things. I think if you want to, to, to be known, you have to, to, to get your, your, your own network. You have to know some key people. Um, there is a, also a, a, a question of um, relationships. But uh, it's, it's quite... There is more opportunity, I think, in, in the U.S., for uh, uh, less known artists to be a bit uh, um, uh, to be a bit um, well, like known, uh, more more popular, known a bit okay. where you, yeah, on, on 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 the web or on some 
radio show or on some cable TV show. Uh, I think it's more easier. There is more opportunity. In France, the people are more closed. Uh, if you're not the friend of somebody, it's a bit di it's a bit difficult to be to be known. So personally, I do music for the pleasure, and I take my time. I try to propose something different. I try to have new opportunities and to to create a good relationship relationships with uh, interesting musicians. To to do my way, to to work on my way, and uh, and. Uh, And that's the that's the thing. Nice, nice, man. So you know what? Um, we're definitely gonna keep you um updated with what's going on because we have our magazines coming out. So we're definitely gonna ship some over to France to you, bro. You know, I mean, definitely would like to have a magazine in France. So you know, um, tell all of our listeners where they can find your music. Well, my music is mainly on Bandcamp, and also for some project on the major platform on the web, only digital. Um. Uh, on Bandcamp, there is uh, all my uh, all my major projects, all my major LPs. All right, all right, man. So, do you want to give any special thank yous or shout outs you you want to give before you go? Yeah, I would like to mention uh, Jay Andrew. He's a, a great musician from Philly. Uh, he's a, I'm a, I'm in touch with him with with uh, uh, since a few years, and I would like to mention Dave, a digger from Paris, a vinyl digger from Paris. Nice, nice. Well, you already know who it is, guys, man. We're about to sign out, but make sure you guys check out all the music on our website. We're going to sponsor a whole bunch of different artists. And right now, like I said, man, we're getting our, our sound waves out to the France, and we're going to be making these moves. We'll catch you later.